Um, what they, they did an awful lot of say, very basic experiments and work, and found that we are really rubbish at making decisions faced with ambiguity. We have all sorts of cognitive biases, and we have, actually have quite high confidence in our decisions, and they're generally rubbish. And he did this with a lot of professional groups, cancer doctors, statisticians, economists, and was quite easily able to put them into situations and give them questions that they really should have known better, and they consistently got wrong. Um, and what he realized is that you know, we're, we, get we, we get wedded to our own brilliance. Um, we're blind to the obvious. You know, if we've got skin in the game and we came up with a plan, we think it's a great plan. We're quite defensive about anybody pushing back on it. We don't recognize that, you know, you know it's, I'll give you some examples of defenses later on, but we don't recognize that our plan is probably completely imperfect. We don't recognize the assumptions in it, all the stuff that's going on here. The CIA have done some great research on this. Um, uh, and they, they, what they found was that they found there were three things that improve the quality of a decision. And they're talking here about a, a, an an intelligence analysis, but effectively it's a recommendation, you know, taking a load of ambiguous data, making a recommendation. What should we do? They found there are three things that will influence that. Uh, more data, a better methodology, the way we think about the problem. Which one of those do you think makes the biggest difference? More data? Better methodology? A few people? So the answer, you know, I'm kind of leading you... Uh, to an obvious solution on this, but more data makes almost no, there's a hygiene level. You need a minimum level of data below which you're just flying in the dark. But what they found was above the hygiene level, when you gave people more data, all they got was more confident in the decision. The decision didn't get any better. It was still about the same chance of it being right, no matter how much more data you got. They just got more confident. Uh, better methodology, you know, the methodology is normally the bit that's okay. We're quite good at working out how to analyze the problem. The problem is how we think about it in the first place. We think about it from a very, you know, from our cultural background, from our work background, because we've got skin in the game, because the organization's incentivizing us to think in a very narrow way. And this is the, the crux of the issue, especially when you're in this sort of ambiguous, fast-moving environment. 